I do believe it has to be done. Uh, someone has to be held accountable for what happened. Jim Sperling is a flood victim who was part of a class action lawsuit against the state of Michigan. I had, I'm going to estimate 20 some feet of water in my home. The lawsuit alleges neglect of the Edenville Dam leading to mass flooding and destruction of property. T.J. Buholtz is the spokesperson for the law firm representing Sperling. The state of Michigan at the end of the day since 2018 has been the responsible regulator for these dams and, and uh, needed to act accordingly. They needed to monitor the weather and they didn't do that here. Um, they could have opened these dams and let water out. They didn't do that. The state has 30 days to file a response from the date of the filing of that lawsuit. We're told that hasn't happened yet, but earlier we did speak with Attorney General Dana Nessel who says Michigan is not at fault. The state had nothing to do um, with these operations, had nothing to do with the failure that we saw this past week that ultimately caused the dam to breach. Buholtz disagrees and is looking forward to the matter being settled in court. At the end of the day, we want to make sure that the people here are made as whole as they can be. The lawsuit is seeking monetary damages for people like Sperling, who say right now they need all the help they can get. They tell me I don't have insurance. There's nothing's covered. You know, and I'm, I'm totally destroyed in the house. Every appliance, every piece of furniture, every piece of clothes that we had is, is gone. Reporting in Midland County, James Felton, WNEM TV5.